Hello students! Today is going to be an adventurous day. We are all going to go exploring in the tropical rainforest. Does everyone have their hiking boots on? We are going to discover the different qualities that each level of the rainforest has. We will be climbing each of the levels, the forest floor, the understory, and the canopy, in order to learn how each level contributes to the rainforest and the different animals that live in each of the levels. I'll be your guide through this adventure, so pay close attention so you don't get lost. All right, we've made it to the forest floor. Look at all the action going on down here. There are so many animals. The forest floor is a very dark and damp place because not a lot of sunlight reaches all the way to the bottom of the rainforest. It is estimated that only 2% of sunlight reaches the forest floor. Due to the fact that sunlight doesn't reach the forest floor, there aren't a lot of plants that live here. Let's check out some of the animals that live in the forest floor. The forest floor has all of the big animals living in it. Check out that jaguar. Other animals that call the forest floor their home are leopards, tapirs, tigers, and gorillas. There is just so much animal life in the forest floor. The understory lair is amazing. There are so many vines everywhere which make it easy for monkeys to swing from tree to tree. The understory is very dense and there isn't a lot of sunlight in this part of the rainforest due to the fact that the canopy blocks most of the sunlight. Even though it doesn't look like there is a lot of animal life in the understory, this part of the rainforest is hopping. Take a look at this tree trunk. This is how big most of the trunks are in the understory. There are so many animals that live in the understory. Frogs and snakes love this part of the rainforest because of how dense it is and they can soak up all the moisture. You can also find many types of monkeys, such as sloths in the picture showing. And butterflies are all over the understory too. Last but not least is the canopy. This layer of the rainforest contains all of the large trees that seem as if they reach to the sky. The canopy is a layer that gets the most rain and sunlight. The large leaves of the tree block most of the rain from getting down to the other two layers. This is also the only layer of the rainforest that contains the most plants. Their roots don't reach the ground, so these plants are called air plants. How neat! The canopy has so many animals that live in it. There are lots of birds, such as the toucan in the picture. There are also many lizards, snakes, and insects. It is just full of life. Wow, what a great adventure. I can't believe we've made it to all three levels. We have learned so much. We learned what each level's job was and what animals lived in each level. I can't believe how much action is always going on in the rainforest. I had such a great time taking you on this adventure and I can't wait to see you next time.